guys and welcome back to another lippy review. So today we're doing one by Pacifica, which I know their lip balms are very hit or miss for me, so... Uh, am I nervous? Yeah. But am I hopeful? Also, yeah. So this is the Indian Chai one, so I'm like, okay, okay. I think they might be able to work with that. Love the packaging, anyway. Uh, so it's 100% vegan, and it's cruelty-free, it's plant-powered, clear formula, bye-bye chap lips, formulated without beeswax, synthetic flavor, petroleum, or mineral oil. Leaping Bunny certified, love a rich, creamy, and highly moisturizing lip balm with coconut jojoba oils and natural flavor. Directions apply to lips, look beautiful. Aww. Every true beauty knows it's what's on the inside that matters. Formulated without parabens, phthalates, SLS, or mineral oil. So their ingredients are coconut oil, candelilla wax, olive fruit oil, jojoba seed oil, castor seed oil, flavor, cocoa seed butter- hold on. Okay, sorry about that. Sister meltdown again. Anyway, so... We've got cocoa seed butter, rosemary leaf extract, sunflower seed oil, stevia extract, and tocopherol. So, all natural stuff, all good. So, format-wise, it is a stick. Come on. Come on out. Alright. So, loving the aesthetic. Actually, of all the ones I've had so far, this may be my favorite aesthetic they've ever used. Like, my goodness. It's purples. It's very hippie looking. Yeah, I know it's like Indian inspired in reality, but like, to me, it reads as hippie. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm into this one. Um, trying to get the plastic on it to start. It's got perforated, but like, it doesn't want to. Okay, there we go. Alrighty. So it's like a very matte label, so it should be easy for you guys to see it now. Oh, also, sparkles! So, you know, one more point in its favor in my book. So, it is just a typical, run-of-the-mill lip balm stick. Yeah, I had no chill, I had to smell. <laughs> um, anyways, it's got the little divot in the top, much like a Nivea or, what, or whatnot. I know lots of brands are using that now, but I think Nivea did it first. So, price on this is $4.99, which isn't terrible. I mean, it's a little, a little higher than I'd like to pay, but at the same time, it's fair. It's fair. Um, size is 0.15 ounces, so a standard stick. Uh, it's not part of a set. It is part of a line of lip balms that Pacifica does. Um, it's not limited edition. It's not medicated. No SPF, no special features. So let's talk about that lovely scent that I gave myself a preview of. I am again. Just double checking. No funny business on it. No, we're looking good. Okay. Oh, that smells good. This smells almost identical to the Burt's Bees chai tea. Or just, I guess they could just call it chai now. But, um. Oh, that's so good. Actually, it might even be a touch sweeter than theirs. I would have to check them side by side, but I really, really like that so far. So hopefully the formula is great, too. Oh, I also just noticed, huh, my eye makeup is totally, like, accidentally matchy-matchy with the aesthetic, but cool. Anyway, um, oh, that smells so good. Hopefully, hopefully it goes on, but please, please, please be a good formula. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Okay. I think this might be my favorite Pacifica lip balm I've ever tried. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Mmm, flavor leaves a bit to be desired. Uh, it's kind of like the banana one in that it kind of tastes like a postage stamp, but other than that, so far I love everything. Flavor, mm, but I mean, everything else, everything else is great. Like, I would say it's on the borderline between thin to medium in terms of thickness. It's not sticky at all. It's really creamy. 
is very silky. No chap, no chaps at all through it. That is really solid. I was not expecting much. Like I said, this brand is so hit or miss. I never know what to expect from them. I am so pleasantly surprised right now. Um, and even though it's like practically all oils, yeah, it's got some shine to it, but it's not like high gloss. So, I mean, it's kind of like a, a dewiness to it, almost. Like, I mean, I'm cool with either, but for those who don't want like super shiny, but are cool with like a little shine, this might be more your speed. I like it. I'm really liking it. Let's try it with some tea, actually. I didn't plan that out in advance, and no, it's not chai, but I mean, you know, thematically appropriate anyway. Stayed perfectly put. Damn! I'm shook. I'm shook. I think truly the only thing I can say, but actually, wait, let me check one thing. Oh, no, no, we're good. We're good. Okay. My only issue with it then is that it tastes like a postage stamp <laughs> or like envelope glue. But other than that, other than that, this is like a 9 out of 10. I am so shook. But my god, I really like that. I am so happy because I was like, if this one ends up sucking, I might cry because I had such high hopes for it, but it did not disappoint. So I'm so happy that it actually lived up to my expectations for it. Ah, anyway. So anyways, that is it for this one, guys. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like my do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time, see ya.